See, I like to imagine that every time I'm on camera, I look like the baby from Eraserhead. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everyone. Welcome back. <laughs> I wish I looked like Pinhead. Oh, that'd be, pr- that'd be, that'd be the life. Um, I have no memory of where we were because Jamie and I got uh, absolutely <laughs> shittered last. I think that's a fair assessment, right? Yeah, I was going to say that to you. Um, your Xbox has a better memory than I do Yeah. about where we were. I'm yeah, we... Was it the second episode we started drinking or... Mm. We recorded three episodes last time. Yeah, it was about around the second one. Yeah, second to third one, we each polished off a bottle of wine. <laughs> Which is funny enough, that's after the the mommy milkers conversation. So that was a sober conversation. <laughs> <laughs> just for the record. That was just normal conversation. That was just and then everything else after that just kinda of went downhill more. <laughs> also we're we're, we're we're trying a new camera angle and from my position it's all just the webcam from me. <laughs> uh, so if I'm shit at playing this game right now, ah I don't care. Um, so yeah, I think we're, we're, we recruited the one hero last time. Um, and then we had to, we went to go get Garth, the second hero, but then he got captured by, uh, by, I think by Pinhead, actually. Um, I'm Garth, am I right though? They're problem Gar- people. Whoa, 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 whoa. How many, okay, hold on. How many like legit Garths have you known in your life? Just one. Okay. Well, I feel like you're being biased that I feel like you're. You're taking your entire Garth experience on, on that person. I don't think I've ever... What the fuck do you want, dog? Oh, you want me to dig? Okay. Um, bork, bork, bork. Bork, bork. Bork. There's a hair that wasn't mine in my mouth. That's not okay. That is really disgusting. Yeah. Oh, I got a condom. <laughs> <laughs> That's so awkward. Yeah. It's forest porn. Well, at least um, it was in... A sealed package still? Yes. So that's oh my god, Pupper. Why do you keep finding things? Yep. This, this is a very popular spot in the forest. To just toss your condoms? <laughs> no, it's a very popular spot in the forest. Oh, I see what uh, you're saying. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Point, nudge, nudge. Yeah. People are fucking in the woods. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they like this place. Just pulling out their mommy milkers. <laughs> Okay. Okay, okay, can we now go on our path? Anyways, we have to go to... We must oh. leave here. This is not a safe place to be. Uh, we have to go to the, the place that he's held captive, but they're only recruiting guards that win the arena. Ah. Uh, so then we're, we're heading to the arena to then win, to then get hired, to then break Garth out. Okay. I'm do that again. I recall... Uh, yeah, remember the, the ten <laughs> ways? The arena is better in this one than Fable 1, if I remember right. But I also might remember wrong, so... <laughs> Also, our memory is not great. Yeah. Oh, I thought that man was T-posing around us. I was like, what a fucking... What a, what a flex. <laughs> oh, no. Walk away quickly. <laughs> <laughs> Only turn right on Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Actually, my favorite town crier line in this game is, The time is now very late. <laughs> Ooh, clothing traveler. Tra- trader, Jesus. We got some gloves, some boots. Oh, these are like proper. Oh, those are. Oh, they're like checkered pants. Okay, those are kind of cool. They don't go with anything we wear. We got that jacket too, as well. It's a much nicer jacket than what we have. Uh, how about that for a nice jacket? <laughs> mm, no. Do you want to do the the pants and? Uh, well, what are we? Hold on, what are we wearing? I don't even remember. We are wearing female wrestler. Oh yeah, we got the like the pantaloons. <laughs> yeah, I think we could trade our pants. Yeah, we should. No, trader, come back. I want I want your pants. What would it be? I would like the classic checkered trousers, please. We gotta move up in the world now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then we're still loving this this top though, right? That top is amazing. Okay. You're really quite the fuck you just say to me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe we should smile more. Is that the next thing you're gonna fucking say? All right, let's go. Oh, traveling game master. No, thank you. That's how you get something slipped in my drink. If you're a traveling gambler, like that's a red flag, right? I would think. But having not met one. 
What? Where? But what? Where? I don't what? like wander down back alleys where people are like three card ante. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> right? I don't know. What a prize! <laughs> Are there still alleys like that? I wouldn't know because I don't go in them. I feel like there are still alleys like that, but you don't hear about them because the people never come back. <laughs> Probably not. I don't... If I was, do I even need to fight these people? I don't even know. I also just realized we're still using the fucking... Yeah. <laughs> the energy sword from Halo. Why not? Uh, where do I go? I guess this way. I don't... Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, I've made a tactical decision where my drink is now a 30 mile radius away from me. There we go. Mine is awkwardly under the microphone. I know. Uh, we really should invest in, like, some side tables. <laughs> you know? Like, so it's just like, oh, I need my drink. But also, like, I'm Beep. like, enjoy the sound of me drinking. Yeah. Well, everyone just, just, just revel in this. <laughs> <laughs> oh gross that was so <laughs> queued up together Ugh. okay uh yes ah oh, there she is hello hammer oh i forgot how loud this game is You guys want to hear some behind the scenes stuff that's fun? <clears throat> so we got these two LED panels, super bright. The lights in this room are actually turned off. It's just the panels bouncing off the walls. Uh, don't stare directly into them because it fucking hurts. <laughs> All right. Well, I bought a new flashlight for work. Okay. And Did you do a lot of work in the dark? No, I just need a flashlight okay. for the things that I do. And um, I was showing it to people. I'm like, don't turn it on. Like and look at it because it's like super bright right i got it at home depot and it was on the wrong like they had two of the same flashlight so one was 14 dollars one was 49 dollars and they had the mislight bolt so i got a oh, 50 dollar wow. flashlight for 15 dollars because it was mislight bolt because i was like which one is it this or this yeah and um it's a bargain it was a huge bargain but the thing is about the size of your cell phone and it shines like the sun. And I was like, don't turn it on while you're looking. Like, check out my flashlight. Just don't turn it on while you're looking at it. Every single person turned it first, on. They're first like, fucking thing they do. A yeah. flashlight. <laughs> and I was like, well, I already said. <laughs> it's, it's like a Matt in the Alan Wake uh, yep. recording. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, she just killed a man for the first time, and it's like, that shit was fucking cool. <laughs> Do it again tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't remember the line from Always Sunny where it's like, I've killed and I've got a hankering to do it again. <laughs> oh, no, I burned down my roommate's bedroom and I have a hankering to do it again. You guys are like Asterix and Obelix. I think you, I think you said that last time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really? Yeah. Okay. No, that's the joy of doing exactly. recordings like weeks apart is you're like, man, I got a funny joke to say. And then you're like, I already did it. Friend. Yeah. <laughs> no, boring. what did, what did, was it, I think J there was, Jacob and I in Need for Speed Most Wanted, I think had the same conversation four or five times with that series. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, it, it just happens. It's just like, you know, cause like the, you're playing a game and it like reminds you of shit. And then you're like, it's been, you know, seven to 10 days since you last thought of this game and you're like oh yeah that reminds me of this or uh, I'm trying to remember the story that Chris tells on the podcast every three weeks oh Chris is so bad he uh, tells me the same story every three days what the fuck story <laughs> is it again and again where we're like oh yeah we don't need to know that <laughs> uh, yeah. and I'm so torn because like if it's someone's first podcast then you know sure yeah. but uh, <laughs> I think it might be the the spurting story with his leg Maybe he's just having some residual trauma and he can't let go. I think so. Yeah, yeah, I think that's true. Honestly, like, I have trauma about that too. That was disgusting. I was literally sitting right here when that happened. Yeah, to those who don't know, we're talking about where Chris's <laughs> old man brittle skin uh, just gave up one day and jets of blood 
<laughs> no, it went so high. It was like a horror movie, and I thought he was being. I don't know. Like I, I was like, <laughs> I kind of thought like it was like he was making a joke in right. some way, right? Because I just I was sitting here like, and we were both playing a game or watching TV, and I just see like this thing shoot up. Yeah. And I was like, just like if that happened to you right now, I was like, bloop. And I was just like. Like, your brain doesn't register, like, what it was. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. are you being weird right now? <laughs> are, you be, are you being weird shooting your blood out again? <laughs> you goof. I thought he was, like, making some sort of joke or something. Yeah, he was pranking but, you. And then, like, then I looked at his face, and it was just, like, <laughs> and he was like, <gasps> and I was like, oh, crap, he is actually bleeding. Um, yeah. Because, I mean, like, I do have blood rigs. I thought he was just making right, a okay. fun thing. Right, okay. Like you just have you just have blood rigs. <laughs> well, sorry. No, I, it makes perfect sense why you do, but it's just like I like. Oh, I just, I, this is the thing I just have in the house. But I I didn't expect like Chris to be able to rig that or yeah. like do it. But yeah, he's a, he's a simpleton. I, yeah, I get I, it. I, I, no, or like <laughs> I, I, I'm just being an asshole. <laughs> he doesn't look through my stuff really. But <laughs> that would imply that he's an interest in my life. <laughs> so can't be impossible. <laughs> I also don't want to look through his stuff, so... Oh, we just had to. Trust yeah, me. it was horrible. No. It's not a thing. But, yeah, so I kind of thought that, because it was just so unrealistically, like, high. Yeah, exactly. It yeah. was something that I would do on, on a set, right? Like, if, if someone was like, oh, yeah, make some blood, I'd be like... Well, I mean, also, I'm that chick that got it on the ceiling. Yeah. And, like, you can't get it off now. <laughs> it's always in the studio tiles or <laughs> in the hair makeup trailer. It's just like, yeah, yeah that weird kind of off brown smear is. Yeah. That, that was me. That was Killer Cheerleader 4. <laughs> yep. Yeah. But then he was like, it's my actual leg. And I was like, but it was real calm. Um, I'd like to make a humble request to uh, panic because I'm bleeding from my foot. <laughs> And I was like, I think I'll probably be driving you to the hospital now. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's fair. So that's the squirt story. We now, now we've told it again. God damn it! <laughs> Fuck. It's better <laughs> coming from us, though. Yeah, yeah, because we we can say more than <laughs> I, I don't want to shit on Chris. We can say more than three words a, a fucking every ten my seconds. Leg. <laughs> so my leg <laughs> spurted. <laughs> I love I love Chris, but man, his storytelling skills are just like, it's like every word is just a journey to get to. And I've been working on a thing that uh, I don't think this is too personal. I've started seeing a therapist lately, just because I you know I got I got some demons. I gotta, I gotta work on some shit as as most people do. And uh, one of the habits we've noticed I do, uh, and I hate about myself, is I finish people's sentences. Oh, I do that too. I fucking hate it. I can't stand when people are taking a while to get to the end of the sentence, so I will be like, I'll help them, quote unquote, by by getting there first and just helping out. Uh, Chris is awful at that of me being like, I know where the story's going, and I just wanted, I just want to say what it is. Oh, However, I try, I try to count so hard for this, but I'm doing it right now. But I have this thing where people are talking in mid sentence. I just say the thing that they're about to say in a yep. different way, and it's really bad. Yeah, no, it's, it's an awful habit to have, it's and I'm trying to break habit, it. And, uh, and everyone else hates that. However, in like a weird twist of universal fate, and like I think like the perfect test for me, my therapist is the worst person in the world for remembering what word he wants to use. So, like, <laughs> yes. So I'm sitting in sessions, and, and he's talking to me, and I'm like going. <laughs> He's like, it's like, I don't want to say an exact sentence because it's a little personal, but like, oh, another thing we're talking about is how I speak very quickly, right? And it's like, you, you speak with such a, um, like a sense of, um, uh, and my brain's like, urgency, 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 <laughs> urgency. And I'm just sitting there quietly going, because mm-hmm, I can't do the thing we're actually talking about me getting better at doing Aww. to my therapist. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's like, uh, like I, I kid you not, fucking 15 seconds go by of him trying to figure out, like, like just, he's he just lost, which it happens, you lose words, right? Oh, yeah, well, that I do too, but, like, when someone else is talking, I yeah. have a lot of words to say. But then, then, but then, then he says urgency, I'm like, mm-hmm. I'm like, I don't know. Yeah, fuck, it's, it's, it's actually, like, the weirdly the perfect thing to have happen, where it's, like, even just, like, when we're not practicing shit with him, I am. <laughs> I went to a therapist too, but it was like a while back, um, before the whole pancake situation. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. 
and the therapist was like, you need to relax, so I need you to, to, like, just sit still, listen really hard, and list all the things you can hear. And I was like, that's the fucking problem. Yeah. I can literally hear 48 things right now. Yeah. And the, and this is this this is the problem scenario. Like, this, the scenario is that I can hear these things and I don't want to listen to them. Yeah. <laughs> not how many can I list. <laughs> yeah. Because that's not the problem. I can, I can do that for days. <laughs> right. The issue is I, I would rather not. <laughs> you don't understand. Uh, sorry, we've clearly miscommunicated. <laughs> right. She's like, you need to relax. So, like, can you start listing things that you hear? Yeah. And I'm like, no, the problem is that I can hear all these things. Yeah. And I've been hearing them, like, every second since I've been in here. <laughs> so. <laughs> I wish I was hearing voices. It would distract me. <laughs> right. <laughs> like, please, like, help me out here. <laughs> yeah, therapy's weird, dude. It is very weird. It's good, but like it, it's just like it's such a weird concept to talk to someone, um, just about like just like like I guess like I don't know it's like, I have like a reflex to be like guarded as a person, so like to mm-hmm. just be like bleh is just super strange to me. I don't like I'm not a, uh, against it or like fighting it. It's just like this is weird. The weird thing to me is like the problem I have. I don't know going to it is that the person that I'm seeing is, like, paid to be there. Right. So I'm sure that they, like, know more than me, apparently, about (laughs) things. But at the same time, they're only listening because they're, like, getting paid $57 an hour to, like, listen to that shit. I I mean, that is a weird (laughs) weird thing. I will say, like, the the one thing that I found, because it, it, you know, I I did therapy when I was younger, and then I, I didn't do it for basically my entire life until this year. Um... You really got to shop around. It's unfortunate, yeah, but like no, you really, a lot of people yeah. try therapy and be like, oh, that therapist didn't work. And so I'm, I'm done now. Like it, therapy isn't for me, but it's like, no, there's bad therapists. There's bad people there, in every profession. Some really bad ones. Yeah. Every profession has people who are shit at their job. And so, and like the, honestly, the bad ones really and, make you feel like they're getting paid. Like, yeah. And I mean, like there yeah. are people that really care. So yeah. I, I can't like discount everything. No, but I know what you mean. Cause like, I, I went through a couple trying to like find someone that works for my situation and, and, yeah. and that I, I feel comfortable with and can vibe with. And uh, yeah, there's people where it's like, I can like hear in, in the way you're speaking, I can hear you counting the minutes right? and doing the math. Like I can just like, sense just it. Just sit down and meditate for 10 minutes more yeah. or something. Right. Have you ever thought about not thinking it. about these things? It's like, oh shit, <laughs> fuck you, right? Never. God, what what a fool I was. <laughs> <laughs> Never thought of that by myself. Yeah. But I also have the like background scenario of um, genitorial experience, very specifically cleaned. Um, therapist's office. Oh. And um, I can tell you. If you're a therapist and you have 15 clocks in your room you're not a good therapist oh my god that's awful <laughs> like i was it gave me anxiety just, just to tick, be tick, 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 in tick, there and i'm like yeah. what are you like captain hook or <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> I like how that's your go-to time right? reference <laughs> or also like i went to another office and like they required us to put away the dishes like they would clean their own dishes but they wanted us to put them away okay and they just had all of their cutlery in one drawer but like not organized all they did <laughs> i was like i don't think that you are eligible to like talk to anyone about their brain yeah like 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 if if, <laughs> if i'm expected for you to help me like help me organize my thoughts <laughs> but i don't like that put away cutlery yeah if you if, if 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 my brain is currently like the Tupperware drawer and I need someone to sort that shit out, <laughs> yeah. uh, I feel like they're not, yeah, they're not the most qualified. You're not qualified. Sorry. Like if you can't figure out where spoons go, then. That's actually, that's actually the final <laughs> when you get your, your, your doctorate is they present you a, a cupboard and <laughs> you have to put all the spoons away <laughs> and they, they look at you and go, nope. sorry, no. I, well, maybe going through that kind of school for that takes yeah. away that ability. Maybe. It could be possible. Maybe, maybe or maybe it's like like uh, connected where the more organized your thoughts become the more disorganized your reality becomes yeah i kind of looked at that stuff and i was like i don't know if you're like qualified to help people 
<laughs> but, I, mean, well, I love how you're throwing shades <laughs> after hours. Well, you do. I mean, it, I, know, I know. It's like cleaning up after fitness instructors and they have like 30 packages of Skittles in the garbage and then they bitch to you about like not being able to lose weight and you're like, I know why you're not losing weight. <laughs> Because you're not eating enough Skittles. Look at all these I found in the garbage, how empty they were. <laughs> more Skittles means more weight loss. <laughs> you just get to know people's vices. Yeah. You take their garbage away. Oh, my God. You really, I guess, yeah, you really fucking would. You, you would have a full understanding of the human experience. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You'd make a great psychiatrist or psychologist or therapist or whatever where, like, here's what we need to work on. It's like, how do you know? It's like, I went through your garbage the other night. <laughs> I snuck, I went to your house. I rummaged through your trash. And, uh, and now I know exactly what we need to work on. <laughs> to be fair, I never actually went through anyone's garbage. I just looked at the top of it. But right. Their even, most recent trauma. Then, <laughs> yeah, right. Even then. No, that could be like a true therapy thing because you look at it and you're just like, Wow, that's a lot of nail clippings. Oh my <laughs> like, God. I don't know. <laughs> Man, you got you got toenails for days. <laughs> <laughs> I think you should stop. <laughs> oh, I think we're in the Balverine section. Oh yay. Sorry, were you done talking? Oh. The steel cutlass is better than our sword. Well. Is it time? I think it's time. I mean right. that was beautiful, but yeah, you're right. And then we get a bong as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God, I wish you could do Deepak's amazing ability to, to replicate that noise. Have you ever heard it? No. He'll get like a glass and like suck it half up to his mouth. And because it's in like the glass and the bubbles are blah, 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 blah. He can, I'll see if I can try. Hold on. Okay. Like he'll, he'll, he'll go like. I can imagine Deepak. I don't, I don't know if that caught through the pop filter, better. but yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's a talent. By the way, I think we're at time, so I think this is a good place to... We made it through the bandit camp, and now we're in... Uh, I'm also realizing how many like double beats there are from the first game, because remember that bandit bridge we had to get past? That? It's kind of like this, and now we're about yeah, to do yeah, like the, the werewolf section now. Uh-huh. Uh, so yeah, we'll see you guys next time, and uh, uh, goodbye. <laughs> There's a... Ciao. It was a burp from the bong. <laughs> All right, bye.